Welcome to EDU IT Tutorials. Please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon for get the latest updates. In this video, we will see complete data center configuration in VMware 7. Here, we are using two Dell servers to install the VMware ESXi 7 hosts and one SAN storage. Let's see the hardware configuration of servers. Two number of Dell PowerEdge R440 servers with 192GB RAM to 480GB hard disk with RAID 1. One Dell EMC ME4102 model SAN storage with 6 number of 1.2 TB hard disks. First, we need to configure the IP address and password for ID rack of Dell Power Edge servers using the lifecycle controller. Then we can log in the hosts using browser in any system. Set up and configure VMware ESXi7 host to configure the data center in V spare V center 7. Now log in the first Dell server 192.168.12.252 using browser. Now open the virtual console. Now click on connect virtual media. Now choose the VMware ESXi host ISO file which is already download from the internet.
Now click on map device. Click on close. Now click on boot and select the visual CD slash DVD slash ISO option. Click on S. Now started ESXi installer. Now log in the second Dell server 192.168.12.253 using browser. Now Click on Connect Visual Media. Now choose the VMware ESXi host ISO file. Now click on Map Device. Click on Close. Now click on Boot and select the Visual CD slash DVD slash ISO option. Now started ESXi installer. Click continue. Click on accept and continue the license agreement. Scanning is in progress for available devices. Storage device is detected. Select enter to continue. Use default keyboard layout. Give the root password. Now select the install. Installing is in progress. Now start the ESXi to server. Click continue. Click on accept and continue the license agreement. Scanning is in progress for available devices. Storage device is detected. Select enter to continue. Use default keyboard layout. Give the root password. Now select the install. Installing is in progress. Now disconnect the 
virtual disk in ESXi host 1 and restart the server. Now disconnect the virtual disk in ESXi host 2 and restart the server. Use static IP address. Now assign the IP address for ESXi host 2 as 192.168.12.11. Give the subnet mask and gateway. Give the DNS address.
give the host name. Now, assign the IP address for ESXI host 1 as 192.168.12.10. Give the subnet mask and gateway. Give the DNS address. Give the host name. 